So you watch all those YouTube tutorials on how to get that quality on Instagram. You apply those settings and it is still not working. Then this video is for you. Hey guys, what is up? My name is Aussex. Welcome back to a brand new video and how to get that crispy full HD quality on Instagram easily using Photoshop. Also, you can apply the settings on Pixar or any mobile applications. So watch till the end to know my secret Instagram quality settings. So before you start, always create a new document size. You have to remember that Instagram is a portrait oriented platform. So everything you see on Instagram is fully optimized for portrait time. So what will be the ratio? The perfect aspect ratio will be 4 to 5 or 1080 into 1050 pixels. And if you are on Photoshop, keep this at 72 and copy this exact settings. Now let's assume that you have finished a composite so now you have to export now there are many ways you can export a picture on photoshop quick export as png export as and save for web legacy now apart from quick export as png you can go for export as setting but i personally use save for web legacy and here's why in export as you can see you have only these settings and if you post on instagram it is not for you it may help you but the quality will not be good cancel this and now go to save for web now you see we got extra settings now there is a misconception that youtubers say keep your quality below 80 but don't do that keep it in 97 or 98 but if, if the file size is too large then you can keep it as an 87 or 90 so usually you get that 1.2 mb or 700 kb so if you check this optimize button it will optimize your content for instagram so your picture doesn't get compressed so click on this now in preview section here's a catch you can either go for internet standard rgb or use document profile i have tried it the best setting is use document profile and image size again 1080 into 350 or you can also try 2700 into 3375 both are fine but 2700 makes your picture big on instagram but again the pixel limit is 30 mb but i guess it, this may compress a little bit but i highly recommend you to go for 1080 into 1050 and quality check on by cubic sharper now hit save and you are done now for mobile you won't have this option but always keep the ratio 4 is to 5 and you won't have quality problem just don't let instagram size your picture because while doing it it the picture may get compressed so if you found this video helpful don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you on my next video